What's good with y'all? It's your boy Shook, and today I'm gonna be talking about why if you're in sports, you gotta you should stay in sports. Now I'm gonna be talking about why basketball changed my life, and like I find it crazy that if I wasn't if I didn't didn't play basketball, how different my life would have been, and where I would be at today, and like the lessons I learned from it and such, like. I'm 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 gonna get right into it. So basically, to start off, when I was like around like grade six or seven, like in middle school or whatever, like I was like one of those kids that played a whole bunch of video games. I was fat, and to make matters worse, I was like, I I didn't look too good either. And on top of that, what made it worse was that I'm like I'm a pretty tall person. Like I'm right I'm right now six foot one. So basically what happened was since I'm like a tall person and I'm like, <laughs> like in grade six or seven, I was like really fat and ugly, you know, I didn't have any self-confidence in myself. And on top of that, I'm tall. I just generally stood out from most people just because I was taller than most people. So it even made me even more insecure about myself and such. And I was like playing nonstop video games, eating like trash, like, yo, like I'm telling you, like, my grade seven self or grade six self, like it, it was hideous. It was it was straight up hideous. But anyways, I started playing basketball. And honestly, when people say ball is life, like as, as cringy as it may sound, there's some truth to it. Cause when I started playing basketball, there's so many things that changed in my life. And like, because I played basketball, they're still in my life today. To start off, like when I, First, when I started playing basketball and such, I like I lost a whole bunch of weight. Like I was really fat. Like I like I was really really fat. Like like I might have to show you guys a picture one day, but maybe maybe another time. You know, it, it's an exposing picture. I mean, it's it, it's exposing. But anyways, I used to be fat, bro. Like I mean, fat. And then because I played basketball and had a lot of cardio in it, I lost a whole bunch of weight. I stopped playing video games as much. And yo, because I lost all that weight and such, like around middle school and such, I started becoming more confident in myself. I started like, you know, feeling better about myself. I started like naturally looking better as well because like, if you're really, really fat and like you lose a whole bunch of weight, you will notice that you look way better because like there's like fat like off your face and like off your like arms and your stomach and your legs and such. You fit better in clothes and such. You don't look like, you know, you don't look bad in compared to society standards. Cause you know, in society, like we generally will be attracted to people who are in shape and such, right? And then because I lost all that weight and such, I naturally started looking better and such. So because of that, I lost a whole bunch of weight. I started feeling more confident about myself. I started, you know, looking better. Um, and then from that, it led to more things. It led to me, be, since I was a part of a team and such, uh, I entered high school and such. And like I start, I had started playing basketball around grade seven. So I started playing more and more basketball and eventually I got a spot on the team. And then even in high school and such, like, you know, I, like I wasn't like usually the one to talk and such. I was pretty shy back in high school and such. And because I just was just simply on the basketball team, like people knew who I was, you know, like I, I didn't talk to a whole bunch of people, but people would be like, oh, yeah, I seen you in the basketball game. Because, like, you know, basketball in my high school, at least, was really popular and such. Everybody would want to check out the games. Everyone would be at the bleachers and such. So if you were on the team and such, people would know who you are. They'd be like, oh, you're that kid on the basketball team. So, like, because of that, I started gaining more friends and such in high school just because, like, you know, people like people uh, as humans we tend to go over we tend to make friends with people who have common interests with us so like anybody who liked basketball and such they would always be like oh yo you're on the basketball team like you know we talk about basketball and such you know I started making more friends around high school and such and then it got to the point where eventually I was I was fortunate enough to be a captain for two of the years I was in high school and such so then once I was the captain of the basketball team as well um basically like 
more people knew who I was because they'd be like, you know, he's the captain of the basketball team. Everyone knows me because of basketball and such. I almost, in a way, in high school, as like weird as it sounds, I kind of got like a little bit of respect. You know, I got some respect just because I was the captain of the basketball team. People knew that, yo, this guy can hoop. This guy plays basketball. That's his thing. And then besides that, what I also gained from it, like I'm telling you guys, like, do you see how much I've already mentioned so far just because I started playing sports and I, and I stuck to it. And then from that and such, um, because I was so like driven into basketball and such, like I had like aspirations that I wanted to one day play um, uh, after high school and such. So I wanted to do well in school and such. So like by default, like I actually started doing better in school because I wanted to make sure that, you know, if I ever got the chance to play post-secondary, um, I would be able to, I would be able to, you know, play on the team and my grades wouldn't be a factor. So I was actually focused in school, my grades improved and such. And then, you know, on top of that, just to like sum all this up, like literally like uh, what ended up happening is that I gained so many like lessons throughout. Like I started, I picked up on the lesson of being disciplined early and how important it is to get better because, you know, as an athlete and such, anybody who's an athlete knows this. It's like, it's about those like early mor mornings, late nights of just pure working and such, you know, you're not gonna be having as much time to do the other things your friends are doing and such, you're focused on practice, your games, your work working out and such, you know? So because of that, like I got those kind of like discipline, di disciplinary, is that what you call it? Anyways, you guys get what I'm saying. I got some discipline from it. I got some life skills from it. And overall, guys, I just wanted to tell you, if you guys are in sports, stick to it, especially if you're younger and such. Like, honestly, I can't imagine my life right now if I ended up not playing basketball, because if I look back at all the things I gained from it, like just from starting from grade seven and where it led up to now and such, like, it's crazy. And I think if I honestly didn't play basketball, like if I never ended up playing basketball, I would most likely be fat. I'd still be playing video games. I wouldn't be very insecure about myself. I, I definitely would be insecure. I would feel, you know, like my life wouldn't be as good as it is right now. And I'm really thankful that I was able to play basketball at like, you know, grade six or seven. Most people start when they're younger, when they're eight or nine, but I was, I started when I was like 13 or 14 and such, and I stuck to it and I kept playing. And overall, like, it's definitely worth it. So if, you, if you're if you someone out there right now that's playing sports, I'm telling you right now, stick to it because it changes your life. I don't, like, if you're, if you're like just in high school right now, stick to them, bro, just stick to them. Even just play sports now, even just to like get some exercise in, like, you know, you get a whole bunch of cardio, you play soccer, basketball, you do boxing, tennis, hockey, like any of those kind of sports, you know, you, it's good for you, you know, it reduces stress, gets your heart pumping. You get a, you build your social network and such, you, you know, that's all the more reasons to be playing sports and such. So if there's one thing I can leave you guys with is that if you're playing sports or like certain sports, stick to it and keep playing it. For the video, leave a comment below of what you think about it. If you have any suggestions for the next, next video, leave it down below. Give me a like on this video, subscribe to the channel, come support me. Other than that, I'm gonna catch you guys in the next one.